Riders wish Alhambra could become bike-friendly every day after they had their first open street event. Eddie Dagny is one of them. He's a big fan of biking and even keeps his cycling gear in the car. These are my 510s, which I like to use for my trail ride. He rides 15 miles per week, but chooses not to ride to work in the city of Alhambra. Because there's no bike lanes here, there's no laws exist, or drivers are not aware of the bike laws, cycling laws. Richie Bruman feels the same way. He says he got hurt when he rode in the city. It's not good. I got pushed onto the sidewalk and uh, my knees got banged up. Uh, luckily, I wore my helmet. The city of Alhambra is behind in terms of bicycle safety. It's the only city in the surrounding area that doesn't have any bike lanes. And bike riders are not allowed to ride on the sidewalk. Five years ago, Alhambra was invited to join in a bike master plan with five other cities in San Gabriel Valley. But the city decided not to participate. Alhambra has tried many times to build more biking infrastructures, but they all failed. While well, last year the city drafted a general plan, which includes a map of potential bike lanes, and supporters hope that one can give the city a shot to become more bike friendly. Alhambra Planning Commission voted unanimously to endorse the adoption of the general plan. That seeks to address the issue of bicycle and pedestrian safety and maybe emulate downtown LA. There's a bike lane that's two ways on Spring Street in downtown Los Angeles, which is a car city. LA County Bicycle Coalition says the city's leadership is important. Mayor Vera Ragosa was mayor here in LA. Um, he almost got hit riding a bike. And after that, he started really pushing hard for a lot of infrastructure projects. If the leadership at the top really wants to make it happen, they can. Benson Lam owns a bike shop on the border of Alhambra and San Gabriel for 15 years. He says lacking awareness of cycling laws is also one of the issues. The bigger issue is the drivers, um, the, the lack of attention, um, people texting. It doesn't matter if the bike lane is present. Um, if someone's veering into the bike lane because they're unattentive as a driver, then that causes a bigger issue. The city is moving forward on the plan. Supporters hope this day can come soon. For Alhambra Source, I'm Leia Chang.